you are so serious about making money, this is the channel for you. Hello there and welcome in this lecture in which we're going to show you how you can utilize ChatGPT in order to create a custom GPT that is specialized in generating banners for YouTube. So let's get right into it. But basically, you know what banners for YouTube are. And let me take you to a couple of channels. We can take a channel that specializes in AI. For example, if we take this particular channel here, you can see that they have a banner and this is the banner. Now, we're going to go ahead and try to do something like this or a GPT that can create banners. Now, it won't be 100% perfect, but with work, we can make it perfect. So let's get right into it. So here, I'm going to go into ChatGPT and I urge you to go ahead and to click on the Explorer feature. Now, once you have clicked on the Explore Preach feature, click on Create a GPT. Now, this time, we will try to do this in a, as five prompts. Okay, so we're going to say, I would like, I would like to create a custom GPT that generates YouTube banner for YouTubers right? or freelancers. So I'm going to hit enter. And of course, as usual, it's going to proceed by telling me what basically uh, giving me some names some name suggestions as well as a logo suggestion for our youtube channel banner creator so right now it is in the process of doing this all right so here it is banner buddy banner buddy seems to be pretty good now i'm going to say name it youtube banner buddy and give it a logo all right give it a logo okay so here, name it a YouTube banner buddy and give it a logo and it will proceed by naming it YouTube banner buddy and giving it a logo, which I will just supervise and see how good it is. Now, also, we'll ask it some questions uh, as usual. What are the be what is the best question to ask someone about their YouTube channel banner in order for you to make sure the banner is good? And another question or another uh, prompt, which would be, for it to not make mistakes when generating the banners for people. So here I'm going to say good logo. Now suggest a question to ask the GPT user in order to generate a perfect YouTube channel banner. And I'm going to put the dot and hit the enter button and proceed. All right, now we have the YouTube, uh, YouTube banner buddy focus. Uh, let's consider an important question. How about uh, this? Describe your YouTube channel's theme and target audience. Okay. Now, this question is good. So, I'm going to say good enough. Right. Good enough. Now, just one more thing. If people ask you to do uh, or to design the banner, make sure that you don't make a grammatical mistake when writing the text on the banner. And if they ask you for a correction go ahead and correct it right away because sometimes it may, might make mistakes when it comes to generating the banner uh, when it comes to text and so therefore we need to allow people to just say correct and they would uh, and uh, it should correct uh, that for them youtube channel uh, youtube banner buddy a creative assistant for generating youtube banner ideas I like it. I like the concept. Now the questions are uh, the uh, the question starters are describe your YouTube channel's theme uh, and target audience. Do you have any specific colors or symbols you want to use? What are some? All right. So pretty much very good questions. By the way, the questions change as we program uh, the GPT. But here uh, it says YouTube channel or YouTube banner buddy is now set up to focus on grammatical accuracy, especially when suggesting. Uh, text for banners. I'll also promptly correct any mistakes it pointed out by users. Uh, any mistakes if pointed out by users. This con this concludes our setup for YouTube Banner Buddy. Feel free to test it out on the playground to the right uh, and see how it responds. Okay, so they're actually uh, prompting us to test it on the playground. So I don't want to go in chat GPT and test it. So we'll test it here and see how it works. And you can test it here by just... Uh, testing it here right and this I, th I believe now this cannot be made smaller but 50 percent of the screen that's good so here i'm gonna say i have i have a faceless youtube channel that specializes 
in YouTube videos about the Lord, the Lord of the Rings lore, the Lord of the Rings lore, and I want you to design a banner for my channel, and the hero of the banner should be the wizard Radagast, right? So I'm going to make Radagast the hero of this particular uh, banner. So let's just wait a second here and see if this is a good GPT. Okay, so let's wait a second. And by the way, in the next lectures, we're going to be relying on Chat GPT to write a series of prompts and to suggest us documents that we could upload to the GPT in order for us to make it a better GPT if necessary, of course. Now, error creating an Im image. Okay, okay, I, I get it, I get it. So basically, when I said Radagast and the Lord of the Rings, it, it basically thought that I'm trying to infringe on copyright. So I'm going to pause this and I'm going to say, okay, just put a picture of a random wizard with a pointy hat from your imagination. Right, so I'm going to ask it to just do it from your own imagination. You don't need to put Radagast if that is infringing on copyright. Now, hopefully this time around doesn't give us a uh, PC uh, or politi politically correct answer by saying, oh, I can't. Uh, but just just so you know, uh, these things are actually good. And it's a good thing that ChatGPT tells you that this is infringing on copyright. Because imagine if it didn't tell you and it just created that and gave it to you. And then you went and maybe had problems. So it's good that they're telling us that this can be a problem in the future. Uh, better safe than sorry, right? So that's something I always like. So here are the images in the process. All right, I like this very, very much. I think this is a pretty interesting uh, banner for a YouTube channel. Now, of course, it requires that we write something on it. Now, I didn't mention the title. So I'm going to say the title of my YouTube channel. YouTube channel is... Now, it should have asked me this, so I can I can basically provide it here. Uh, the title of my channel is the Rings, the Rings Lore, right? The Rings Lore. And I'm going to hit enter. And hopefully this time it provide it puts the, the title. But here I'm going to go to the GPT builder and I'm going to ask it. Make sure to ask. Now, I cannot message both at the same time, I think. But make sure to ask uh, the GPT user about their YouTube channel title, the YouTube channel title, and if they want, uh, if they want their logo as well, must be provided because the, because uh, the GPT can also incorporate the logo, must be provided. Okay, all right. Now we've already created a uh, GPT that creates logos, so now we're creating this one that creates a banner. All right. So for the YouTube channel, the rings lower. Uh, which focus on that da, da, da. here are some suggestions uh so i'm just gonna say please please just place the title in the banner and add a subscribe button and a bell okay all right so let's see okay so here in the left hand side on the gpt builder all right so it, it is generating for me but here youtube channel buddy can can specifically ask users when a youtube channel title uh, about their YouTube channel title, which is good, and whether they want to include their logo in the channel uh, design. Uh, this ensures that the banners are not only creative and well-tailored, but also align closely with the user's brand identity. Good. All right, so I don't know why. This seems to be a little bit weird. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to click on the green button first. I'm going to click on everyone, confirm, so that we can publish our YouTube channel buddy, uh, or banner buddy first. Okay, my, my changes could not be published. There is a lag. So... This can happen. It's good that you're looking at this in action. So there is a lag, um, and a lag can happen, can happen, especially when I try to go fast. But as you've seen, we had some uh, some result. Right now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to say my YouTube channel banner, uh, my YouTube channel title is the Rings, the Rings lore. Okay, and I want you to design a banner for the channel make sure to put the title inside of the banner in special fonts right in a special font golden font golden fiery font and put 
below it a subscribe button along with a bell. All right, so hopefully this time around it gets it right. I'm just going to sit and wait. All right, so how about this? I think right now you must be convinced of our banner creator, which looks fantastic. And I think it will rival that of the best banners out there. So it's safe to, to go ahead for me and to uh, have a look at this in uh, full view. I hope that you can enjoy uh, what you're looking at here. This GPT took us about 10 minutes to create, or I think 11 minutes, uh, but depending on the on our, what our editors are gonna do. Uh, but the, I'm quite satisfied with the result. As you can see, this is really good. The rings lore and uh, subscribe button in the at the bottom, uh, but pretty much I like it. I think this is very very good, uh, and uh, please leave your your results as well in the Q and A section. Let us let us see and have a look at your creations in action. Take very good care. Passive income Gen Z. See you in the next lecture in which we're going to create a custom GPT ad expert this time, which can create amazing Facebook ad copy. Instagram ad copy, Google ad copy, depending on uh, multiple factors. This time we'll do it a little bit differently, but see you in the next lecture.